Good morning, South Florida. I'm Eric Yutze. Here's a look at your top stories on this Monday. A domestic dispute ending in deadly gunfire in Oakland Park. Surveillance video showing an injured woman after she was shot. She is seen getting away from a home near Northwest 52nd Street near First Avenue. Deputies had a standoff with the suspected shooter after he barricaded himself inside a home shared by the two. Authorities hit a man shot himself while inside that home and died at the scene. The woman suffered non life threatening injuries. Police investigating a shooting in Hollywood have prompted a big police response. A man shot and taken to the hospital in critical condition. The SWAT team arriving at a home near Fillmore Street and 26th Avenue yesterday as officers set up a perimeter for a manhunt. Neighbors say they saw a man fleeing that scene with a gun. Authorities using helicopters and canine units as they searched for the shooter. One person was detained for questioning. No arrests have been made. Deadly shooting in West Park also is under investigation this morning. Deputies responding to reports of gunfire Saturday night near Pembroke Road and Southwest 56th Avenue. One woman was shot and was taken to the hospital. That victim later died. Anyone with information that could lead to an arrest is urged to call police. And a one and only local 10 exclusive neighbors in a Miami Gardens neighborhood waking up to a string of car break ins on Sunday. Six cars targeted near Northwest 183rd Terrace and 6th Court. The thief also smashed windows and rummaged through several cars in the next few blocks. The victims do believe it happened about 530 in the morning. Neighbors shared surveillance video of a man walking through the streets. They believe this may be the, be the man who is behind it. And as breaking news happens, we'll keep you covered throughout the day on air and online. Head to local10.com for more local news coverage and updates. Have a nice Monday.